Love Folly Beach Pier has reached its life expectancy. Construction for the replacement pier has been stalled. News 2's Danielle Hinsley investigated the replacement project and finds out why renovations haven't yet started. This very pier first opened in the summer of 1995, but because of deterioration caused by shipworms, the 25-year-old pier is being replaced. In 2013, Charleston County Parks and Recreation began dive inspections of the pilings, which are the posts holding the foundation of the pier, and they found marine boring worms, or shipworms, have caused deterioration. Since then, the agency has been using cement to repair the worst of the damage and to kill those worms. But while the pier has been inspected and ensured to be safe for use, it will continue to deteriorate with worm damage. And so now Charleston County Parks and Rec is working on replacing the pier. But they've hit a setback. Sean McBride, public affairs specialist for the Army Corps of Engineers, which is one of the permitting agencies, says they are waiting on the National Marine Fisheries Service to sign off on a study to ensure no endangered species will be affected by the project. Right now we are waiting on a concurrence letter from the National Marine Fisheries Service on their endangered species critical habitat impacts. Their protective resource division is reviewing that right now and once we get that concurrence from them we'll be able to finalize our permit and uh, issue that to them. McBride says they anticipate for the project to be approved and once they do, Charleston County Parks and Recreation can move forward with the construction process. Um, they will be able to start their project once they get our approval as they've already gotten their state approval from uh, the state agencies. Charleston County Parks told me they are unclear of the timeline for the pier project. They are considering leaving the pier open for the summer, but a final decision has yet to be made. In Folly Beach, Danielle Hensley, Count on Two.